generally speaking candidates having uh, experience will be preferred over those who does not have experience at all So hello and welcome back everyone to our another session with the HR and our today's guest is Mr Sonal Rana who is the senior manager talent acquisition of Leverage Edu He has 12 plus years of experience in the industry he has worked with big brands like Times Business Solution Eternal HR Services Investor Clinic Infratech and currently he is working with Leverage Edu. In this session we will be talking about the hiring process of top MNCs and corporates, the acceptance of online degree and the myths around it. So, it is going to be an informative session for which you will must watch this interview till the end and let's get started. So, let us all welcome Sonal Rana ji from Leverage Edu. Welcome sir. आप अपना ना अभी तक का अपना ओवरऑल एक्सपीरियंस है उसे शेयर करिए हम सब के साथ सो इन स्टाफ रिक्रूटमेंट सो इट्स बीन 12 इयर्स दैट आई हैव बीन इनटू दिस इंडस्ट्री सो आई हैव स्टार्टेड माय करियर विद टाइम्स सो आई हैव टेकन केयर ऑफ ऑल काइंड ऑफ पोजीशंस स्टार्टिंग फ्रॉम एंट्री लेवल टू टिल टॉप लेवल so there has been a uh, lot of uh, niche positions that i've worked on and uh, lots of confidential positions that you got to work on being on the uh, leadership side so uh, experience has been wonderful i have gained a uh, good growth in my entire career and uh, today i am leading a team of uh, recruiters within uh, leverage to so about the changes that i have seen in industry it's been a lot so you used to work manually earlier when i started actually so there was no automation there was no ats installed for uh, recruitment purpose now we have lots of companies with coming up their own uh, ats so bahut easy ho gaya aaj ki date mein uh, screen karna and uh, selections और एक पूरा रिक्रूटमेंट प्रोसेस देखना सो ये बहुत सारे चेंजेस हैं जो इंडस्ट्री में आए हैं एंड आई अभी आपने चैट जी भी सुना होगा विच इज़ कमिंग सो द इंडस्ट्री इज गोना बूम द टेक इंडस्ट्री इज़ गोना बूम बिकॉज ऑफ ऑल दीज इनोवेशंस एंड आई एम श्योर यू हैव लॉट ऑफ मोर इनोवेशन रिलेटेड टू रिक्रूटमेंट Uh, with this chat gpt i have one question random question sure. which is ki uh, do you also think ki log bolte na that chat gpt is going to take uh, jobs of many bahut logo ki job jaane wali hai is that true it's not the same humne bahut pehle bhi suna tha ki jab computers aayenge to logo ki job chali jayegi hmm. jab automation aisa kuch aayega to logo ki job chali jayegi but we need to understand the difference so these are softwares you cannot compare it you know with the human mind so job kisi ke nahi jaane wala hai yeah but uh, that will ease your process actually actually the these are man made uh, yes softwares only so man made cheezon ko replace nahi kar ja sakta right bilkul so can you share the current industry need and the myths around bahut sare myths hai candidates ke man mein around online education so uh industry needs you know it may vary uh, depending on the specific uh, companies and uh, the job role so bahut sari cheeze hoti hain let us talk about a few here so one is uh, technical skills so everyone looks for uh, people who are uh, technically equipped these days so you know the there are uh, growing demand of uh, people with uh, technical strong technical skills also we can talk about uh, soft skills soft skills it includes like uh, communication skills collaboration leadership skills and uh, problem solving skills last uh, diversity and inclusion so la pehle 
you didn't have a team to take care of this DNI part actually in organizations. But currently, organizations want uh, you know people from every from each background culture. It's like that. A recent research hai, that is that around 80% of people opt for online learning, and it has rise up to 220%. And uh, people are accepting online education. Is that uh, equal? I mean, the candidate, the uh, recruitment industry, is there any acceptance there or is there not? Look, there is an acceptance. Hai. So, yes, we have seen a lot of increase in uh, acceptance of online education. And similarly, it has led to uh, you know, an increase in the number of candidates with online education. So, yes, they both are uh, related, but again, recruitment process, you know, could be different. So, recruitment process, which drive hota hai, so despite online education, there are a lot of other factors, what we see actually, which is uh, based on their skills, their education, and uh, their cultural fit and all. So, that employers, uh, are open to uh, accept online degrees these days but yes the program uh, should be from a reputable institution especially okay but fir bhi na abhi bhi students ke around there is this thing that uh, mncs or corporates don't accept online degrees what do you say about it so it's not true at all uh, these days, online education uh, has gained, uh, you know, acceptance worldwide. So, you'll see a lot of universities and uh, good colleges, they offer uh, online education programs. So, employers, they find uh, online education as equal as uh, traditional degrees. But unka jo academic standard, hai, that should be maintained. However, there are still uh, 10 to 15 percent of uh, organizations so they have different eligibility criteria for uh, different different positions where they might prefer candidates having uh, different uh, skill set and uh, a degree program so yes for entry level positions still you might have uh, you know the organizations and their concerns about this but yes if you're a working professional then uh, despite having the online degree you can enter into any MNC or corporates. So there is a whole community, a government job, students, ki puri achi kasi community. Hai. But or what they do is ki wo apna preparation karte hain. Ya fir kai baar kuch students ke saath kuch other problems hoti hain. Tinki hmm. wajah se unki uh, jo career hota hai, usme gap a jata hai. Studies ke baad ek achi kasi teen char saal ka ya eight ten saal ka bhi. Some students have seen a gap with some students. So, when you have candidates who come to your job, how do you deal with that gap? Yes, it's a good question. Uh, we have seen a lot of people who have spent you know, more than five years in preparing government exams. And they have uh, you know, this much of fear of gap because of this. So, gap could be you know, uh, either for preparing government exams or could be any other reason. But you should have a justification of this. If you don't have, then obviously you would have a problem in getting a job. Because everyone would have a doubt in their mind. Koi bhi aapko interview kar rahe, ask, he's gonna ask you this question, ki aap itne time ke beech mein aapne exactly kya kiya hai. Mm. So you cannot just justify this you know, by saying ki haan, maine ye graduation, uh, jo bhi government exams hai, maine unki preparation ki hai. So you should always have a backup plan for this. So you should add value to your profile. You should utilize this time to have some, uh, you know, online degree courses or any other kind of education or other certification programs, whatever you could, you know, whatever you can do. Because it gives you flexibility. Deta hai, uh, sab aapke dono karne ke liye. So simultaneously, you can prepare for exams ke liye prepare bhi kar sakte hai, and you uh, can extra value add in your profile. Mein. So when you'll be sitting there at the uh, interview, so you would have you know proper justification. Justification. So, वो आपको help करेगा to landing into a job there in that particular organization. 
बट इफ यू आर सिटिंग आइडल और आप बोल रहे हैं आपने कुछ नहीं किया है और आपने पाँच साल खाली तैयारी की है गवर्नमेंट एग्जाम्स की सो आई एम श्योर दिस विल हैव यू नो दिस विल क्रिएट अ डाउट इन दी और एक डाउट ये भी तो आ सकता है कि बाई चांस यूल गेट अ जॉब अप यू विल बी लिविंग आर इंडस्ट्री देन तो एक ये क्वेश्चन भी आता है कि बाई चांस हमने आपको जॉब दे दिया और आप स्टिल प्रिपेयर कर रहे हो देन आप कभी भी हमारी इंडस्ट्री छोड़ के जाए एंड इंडस्ट्री नीड अ लॉन्ग टर्म एम्प्लॉय सो इवन वी आस्क दिस क्वेश्चन टू दो स्टूडेंट्स कि सपोज आप आज आपकी गवर्नमेंट एग्जाम के लिए आप प्रिपेरेशन कर रहे हैं बट आपने बहुत सारे एग्जाम्स दिए भी हुए हैं वट अबाउट इफ यू गेट सेलेक्टेड देयर अगर कल को दो महीने बाद या पाँच महीने बाद आपका कोई रिजल्ट आता है सो वट्स आफ्टर दैट आई यू गोना क्विट और यू विल प्रिफर टू स्टे विद दिस ऑर्गेनाइजेशन सो ये क्वेश्चन रहते हैं दिमाग में वाई यू नो सेलेक्टिंग कैंडिडेट बिकॉज वी हैव टू इन्वेस्ट इन अ कैंडिडेट सो हर एम्प्लॉयर जो भी चाहेगा ही वॉन्ट सम वन टू हैव फॉर अ लॉन्ग टर्म नॉट फॉर सिक्स मंथ्स टू थ्री मंथ्स ऑफ टेन डेयर सो आई नो कि ड्रीम को चेस करना बहुत इंपॉर्टेंट है बट उसके साथ साथ थोड़ा सा स्मार्ट वर्क करना भी बहुत इंपॉर्टेंट है दैट इज़ कि अगर आप ऐसा कुछ कर रहे हैं कुछ प्रिपेयर कर रहे हैं तो उसके साथ साथ एक बैकअप प्लान तो हमेशा रखिए लाइफ में एक बैकअप प्लान होना बहुत इंपॉर्टेंट है बिल्कुल विद दिस देर आर ऑल्सो वर्किंग प्रोफेशनल्स हु लाइक टू मतलब वो स्टडी भी करना चाहते हैं साथ में कुछ अपग्रेड करना चाहते हैं एंड इफ दे स्टडी फ्रॉम अब्रॉड यूनिवर्सिटी यू नो देर आर अ लॉट ऑफ अब्रॉड यूनिवर्सिटीज दैट आर ऑफरिंग ऑनलाइन एजुकेशन और ब्लेंडेड हाइब्रिड एनी सो डू यू एक्सेप्ट सच काइंड ऑफ वर्किंग प्रोफेशनल्स यस ऑब्वियसली सो पीपल हु आर स्टडिंग फ्राम अब्रॉड यूनिवर्सिटीज ऑनलाइन दे bring a unique set of experience to the table so uh, you know we always welcome those professionals it also you know uh, demonstrate their uh, time management skills their uh, commitment towards their le- uh, learning and development mm-hmm. so yes also uh, you should always uh, look for the, you know these professional courses and uh, towards the advancement of your profile because uh, that will help you in growing within the same organization so i would always you know advise everyone that go and uh, have uh, you know unique set of skills because studying abroad from even online so it gives you a better exposure towards the problem solving skills because the knowledge what you get you know is really practical rather than having the theoretical knowledge what we have here in india and uh, देर आर ले ऑफ ऑल्सो जैसे बहुत सारी चीज़ों का बूम चल रहा है आई गेस ले ऑफ का भी कुछ बूम चल रहा है तो वट डू यू से अबाउट इट मास ले ऑफ वट इज़ द रीज़न बिहाइंड सच ले ऑफ सो ले ऑफ्स और उसको हम वी कैन ऑल्सो कॉल इट यू नो कॉरपोरेट डाउन साइजिंग और रीस्ट्रक्चरिंग सो रीज़न कुड बी मैनी ठीक है मे बी ड्यू टू इकोनॉमिकल डाउन टर्न और मे बी दी बिजनेस ऑब्जेक्टिव हैव चेंज और द कंपनी इज नॉट एबल टू मीट देयर गोल्स देयर डायरेक्शन यू नो इज नॉट डेट गुड सो देर मे बी लॉट ऑफ रीजन फॉर ले ऑफ बट पीपल हु हैव been gone through and or uh, who are currently in this situation so they don't uh, you know they should be proactive they should not lose patience they should stay positive because losing a job you know could be stressful aap bahut pareshani mein ho sakte hain but at the same time you should look for new opportunities available you should be focused towards the new opportunities available in the market and what are the tips to survive if someone been lay off so unke liye kya tips hain so they should reach out their f- colleagues uh, their uh, family members let them know that they are in uh, that they have been laid off and they are in need of a job so कनेक्शंस लिंकडन पर जाइए अपनी स्ट्रॉन्ग प्रोफाइल बनाइए अपना रेज्यूमे अपडेट कीजिए आप जो भी आपकी अचीवमेंट्स हैं वो सारी मेंशन कीजिए 
and try to learn new things try yes to do new courses yes so i was coming to that point also so while you have a time now so you can decide about the future aapko kuch aur karna chahte hain life mein you have some different plans to us par focus kijiyega uh, you can also go for you know lots of uh, online uh, कोर्स और कोर्सेज और सर्टिफिकेशन अवेलेबल इन द मार्केट जो आपकी हेल्प करेंगे आपके गोल तक पहुंचने में यू कैन थिंक इफ यू नो इफ इन यू वांट टू डू फ्री और यू वांट टू बी एन एंटरप्रेन्योर तो सो वट एवर इज देयर इन योर माइंड दिस इज द टाइम फॉर दिस थिंक अबाउट इट एंड स्टे पॉजिटिव आई एम श्योर इट डू नॉट लूज पेशेंस इफ यू डोंट गेट अ जॉब राइट अवे कीप focusing on the goal and uh, you will get a job within 2 uh, or 3 months for sure so you are currently working with leverage edu right so what is the uh, number of resumes you get so number of resumes uh, it could vary you know from position to position job location mm-hmm. or uh, your uh, online branding your reach so bahut cheezon pe depend karta hai but yes if i talk about number it could be as low as 100 and could be in thousands also so really if within a span of 2 uh, to 3 days you will get this number of applications that means we uh, let's say we are talking about hundreds and thousands of resume cvs yes how do you bifurcate these cvs so like we, uh, do you see the uh, that the the particular candidate have a degree plus skills or degree from a good brand university so bifurcation we have uh, lots of you know ats currently in the market so they automatically uh, filter out the applications which are relevant as per the skill set but yes if you specifically talking about degree and uh, skill set so yes experience could be one of them but again it should not be the only factor it's uh, while you know having experience could be valuable uh, valuable to the organization but we should also look out the different aspects about the skill set cultural fit and other things so bahut sari cheeze hoti hain when you filter a candidate aapko even uh, job boards mein bhi aaj ki date mein bahut sare uh, relevant score mil jate hain जहाँ से आपको कंपेटिबिलिटी का पता चल जाता है डायरेक्टली सो आउट ऑफ थाउजेंड एप्लीकेशन यू विल फाइंड अप्रॉक्स हंड्रेड एप्लीकेशन विच आर रिलीवेंट टू दैट जॉब बी इट फ्रेशर और वर्किंग प्रोफेशनल यू गो विद दी स्किल्स एंड द नॉलेज दे हैव यस सो फ्रेशर्स ऑब्वियसली दे शुड हैव अ डिग्री एंड अलॉन्ग विद स्किल सेट इफ वी वुड बी हैविंग सो विल प्रेफर दोज एंड इफ अ स्टूडेंट इज फ्रॉम टीयर टू और टीयर थ्री सिटीज how can they get a job in such kind of cities or in top mncs uh yeah it's true that uh, every one wants to get a job there in the metropolitan cities uh, candidates from tier 2 and tier 3 cities so uh, what they need to do is they need to be confident they need to be prepared okay so first thing what they need to do is uh, build their resume so while having their resume they need to showcase their skills their achievements and that too in a very clear and concise manner actually so uh, that's a part one right after that you can uh, reach out to your uh, l college alumni any university which is uh, working there in those cities so connections you can reach out to your uh, friends who are currently working there in those cities they might help you in uh, landing a job there in those cities also you can uh, prepare uh, your portfolio on uh, social media sites like linkedin you can go to job boards and uh, like nokri monster founded which is now shine times so prepare your portfolio there it will help you in getting a job you because kya hua hai ki pandemic ke baad mein you will see lot of people who are even you know from those uh, tier 2 and tier 3 cities they are easily getting a job they are working remotely or uh, 
sometimes it's hybrid model they are going to delhi or bombay once in a month and after that they are coming back to their own cities so isse kya hua ki aapka jo diversified candidates ka pool hai wo badh gaya hai so every company is reaching to those candidates apart from this you can uh, apply for internships in within the organization it will give you a good learning first it will give you the confidence and relevant knowledge which is uh, required for the job and uh, do qualification factors out for higher job positions yes uh, it does most of the companies they would prefer having qualification for a different set of role suppose i am uh, looking for someone for a managerial role role so i would prefer having mba for this profile because someone who's having the good leadership skills would be able to lead a team so yes it depends as per the roles as per the requirement of the organization so har company mein they would have higher positions and they would prefer someone having good academic degree for this and uh, if you are talking about higher job positions so what are the five main things you look into the candidate for higher job positions and for the freshers also while selecting process so uh, the first thing what we look at is the skills and experience okay uh, what is skills that the candidate you know possess how many years of experience he is uh, he you know actually carrying to perform the duties and the responsibilities and uh, cultural fit cultural fit jo bhi market conditions hain kya wo adapt kar payega theek hai is he aaj ki date mein we work in a you know very fast paced work environment so is he really eligible or uh, can he work with the same pace qualification yes is he graduate or post graduate whatever you know is required by that particular job and uh, adaptability what i have you know uh, spoke about in the starting also that is he good enough to adapt the new challenges new technologies and uh, discipline and uh, punctuality yes so people should have uh, you know eagerness towards learning सो so, जो भी नई चीज़ें आती हैं बिकॉज कॉरपोरेट्स में क्या होता है नो वन इज़ गोना टीच यू अबाउट द न्यू स्किल्स आपको खुद जाके सीखना पड़ेगा उनके साथ में आपका मैनेजर आपके पास नहीं आएगा आपको कोई भी पर्टिकुलर टास्क सिखाने के लिए सो इट्स बेटर हाउ यू टेक दोज अपॉर्चुनिटीज़ टूवर्ड्स योर लर्निंग एंड डेवलपमेंट सो उसको ग्रैप करना होगा आपको एंड अकॉर्डिंगली यू विल सक्सेड इन द फ्यूचर so let's suppose during the hiring process you have two types of candidates one is having regular mba degree mm-hmm. and the another one is having online mba degree along with two years of experience who will you select and how so uh, generally speaking candidates having uh, experience will be preferred over those who does not have experience at all so uh someone having 2 years of experience will know how to work in an organization he knows how to work under pressure he has seen uh, all the uh, changes and uh, the expectations which is required by their reporting managers so yes if someone with the experience you know and having even an online degree will be preferred and uh, let's suppose where no significant experience is required for a particular job so like uh, entry level positions so people with the uh, mba degree from a reputed institute they could be a stronger candidate there so you definitely do the smart work uh you can go with the program online mba program or any online uh, online program along with your job or uske baad you will have a good 
एक्सपीरियंस जिससे आपके जॉब मिलने के चांसेस थोड़े ज्यादा होंगे एंड सर हम अभी बात कर रहे थे हायरिंग प्रोसेस की तो व्हाट आर द चैलेंजेस आपको ये ही इसी हायरिंग प्रोसेस में आपको कैसे कैसे चैलेंजेस फेस करने को मिलता सो चैलेंजेस वन ऑफ द बिगेस्ट चैलेंजेस इज टू गेट अ राइट फिट सो वी हैव सर्टेन एक्सपेक्टेशंस a unique skill set required for a particular profile so jo bhi applicants aate hain we need to decide who is more relevant to that who is going to be the you know best fit so selecting those candidates out of 1000 applications could be a bit challenging wo thoda lengthy process hai and uh, second is to attract the qualified candidates or uh, talented pool so f- recruitment is a you know process of maximization what you do exactly you maximize your reach to the uh, potential candidates aap usko social media par dalenge aap usko job sites pe dalenge and uh, aap usko jitna zyada maximize karenge accordingly you would have a better pool of candidates after that you have a selection process which is the minimization when you filter out those applications and you get a good candidate out of the pool so that's the another process and what is the one area that a candidate must work on matlab you must have uh, seen or taken a lot of interviews and everything to aapko kaun sa aisa area lagta hai jahan pe lagta hai ki candidates ko zarur work karna chahiye jo aapke liye challenging area raha hai hamesha so uh it could be soft skills like communication these days uh, this is you know in demand so everyone is seeking for candidates who possess good communication skills good interpersonal skills could be a good team player and uh, should have a decent you know technical skills agar aap aaj ki date mein dekhte hain even for the operations role ek entry level position pe bhi you should be proficient on uh, ms excel Outlook and uh, MS complete MS suit, right? तो ये सारी चीज़ें बहुत common हैं आज की date में and someone who doesn't even have exposure to all this, he will have uh, he will face a problem. What is the deal breaker question uh, which uh, <laughs> selects or rejects a candidate? So there is no such deal breaker question. There, uh, you know, when you are uh, going for an interview. so the interviewer has a set of questionnaire so he's gonna evaluate you on different different parameters here theek hai aap ek ha there will be couple of questions a common questions jo hote hain where you have a more weightage so that is how well you are prepared you know for the interview so they may ask you you know what do you know about the organization but why you want to join this organization particularly there are a lot of uh, job openings available in the market so why you are interested in our organization so if you have prepared you have knowledge about the organization you can come up with their business about the things you know uh, what kind of business that they have delivered in the last quarter or last year what turnover they have what are the virtues of the organization their values their objectives goals so if you are able to answer all these questions to the uh, interviewer so he'll be impressed because you have done your homework he knows that you have interest in the organization and you really want to enter at any cost so he will be impressed and yes he will give you more weightage for this so with this we have come to an end of the session and it is very insightful thank you so much for this My and pleasure. i hope the candidates who are looking for a job unke liye ye kafi value provide karega aur kafi help karega ye pura session and we hope ki hum fir mile aur fir aise hi candidates ki problems <laughs> ko solve kare thank you so much my pleasure thank you